Let's crochet the wings. First, make a slip knot like this. Now, put a crochet hook into a loop and tighten the loop. In row 1, we start with 6 chain stitches. Yarn round hook, pull the yarn through the loop on hook. That's one chain stitch. Such a V shape stands for one stitch. Work 5 more chain stitches. Six chain stitches are finished. Then turn and skip the first chain. We work four single crochets from the second chain. Insert hook into the back loop of the second chain. Hook the yarn and pull up a loop through the stitch. There are two loops on hook. Yarn round hook. Pull the yarn through both loops on hook. That's one single crochet. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Then work three more single crochets. Four single crochets have finished. Next, we work one slip stitch and mark this stitch. That's a slip stitch. Then we mark this stitch. Then we work one chain stitch. Row one is done. Turn the fabric and start working row two. Skip this first marked stitch and we work two single crochets from the next stitch. Also place a marker in this first single crochet. One more single crochet. Two single crochets are finished. Next, we work one increase, which means working two single crochets in the same stitch.
Next, work one single crochet. Remove the marker. In this stitch, we work one single crochet. Finally, work three chain stitches. Yarn round hook, pull the yarn through the loop on hook. That's one chain stitch. Two more chain stitches. Now, row two is completed. In row 3, turn and skip the first chain. We work 3 single crochets from the second chain. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Then, continue to finish two more single crochets. Next, we work one increase and two single crochets. That's one increase. Two single crochets followed. Remove the marker. And we work one slip stitch in this marked stitch. Then we mark this slip stitch. Finally, one chain stitch. 